Good morning guys, it is Arika Misha and this morning I am cooking breakfast and I'm just gonna do some old fashioned, old traditional omelets. Um, so I have my favorite, my Publix Jumbo uh, Grade A eggs. I've got some leftover bacon here. I've got some breakfast sausage, turkey breakfast sausages. And I've got some leftover pork. Um, so I'll just, of course, cook this up and make some like little pork crumbles to sprinkle in the omelets. Um, so yeah, that's what we're doing. Um, like I said, old fashioned breakfast omelets. The girls wanted my um, omelets this morning. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that for them. And of course, you know, I love an old, old fashioned omelet. Um, I like bacon, egg, and cheese. I like all that in mine. So, all right, guys, it's time to cook breakfast. Let's go. I'll be back. Okay, guys, as you can see, I am cooking my pork here. And I just put a little season in it. And I'm going to leave it kind of in little, little chunks because I like the little chunks in the omelet, you know? Give you a nice big bite of pork. I could have made little uh, pork patties, but I decided I always leave it like this. Sometimes I make pork patties, but I'm just leaving it like this today. Just leaving it like this. And sometimes I leave it like this where it's all nice and chunky. So I'm getting that cooked up. And then once I put my eggs in the pan, I'll just drop some sausage in there too. So. That's what this is, so. All right, and I have in the air fryer, let's go check on that. I've got the bacon and sausage in our air fryer. Go check on these guys. See how they're doing. Cooking up, they're okay, not done yet. So, we'll get them back in. Let them finish cooking. We'll be back to check on those guys. So we've got everything cooking. And oh yeah, I found some hash browns in my freezer. So some leftover hash browns. I'm sure from one morning I cooked breakfast. So I'm going to go ahead and cook those as well so we can have those on the side. All right. All right, guys. We're getting all the meat cooked up so it can be ready for us to drop in our eggs. All right, guys, I'll be back so we can make these omelets. Okay, guys, I just wanted to come back and show you guys really quick. Um, I've got my meat all chopped up. Of course, you know, I just, you guys saw me just uh, pan fry the pork pieces. Um, I've got the turkey sausage. I've got them all cut up in my bacon. Um, I've got that all chopped up. And I just wanted to show you guys how I do the bacon. I just take my um, kitchen scissors my kitchen scissors and I just cut it like that and I like to keep the meat nice and chunky I don't I don't really like the small shredded pieces I like to keep it nice and chunky so that way when you bite your omelet you've got a nice chunk of meat in there you know I don't really like to shred my meat up so just take my scissors and I cut it up like this Just like that, easy, easy peasy. And I air fried my bacon. You guys go back and watch some of my videos. You guys have seen me air fry bacon a million times, so. And see how that bacon gets all nice and cut up? I use the kitchen scissors. Don't use y'all home scissors now. Nah. The, the scissors that the kids use for school, don't use those. The kitchen scissors. Those are the cooking scissors. I don't know. If you ain't got cooking scissors, you know, you might have to use them school scissors. Yeah, y'all. You might have to use those. Whatever. Do what you got to do to cut your meat. <laughs> oh, anyway. <laughs> Alright, guys. So, I've got my meat all chopped up. And just wanted to come and show you guys a little, you know, a little clip of that. How I got everything all chopped up. So, we can just drop it in our omelets. 
I'll be back guys so we can finally get these omelets cooked. Okay guys, we are back to cook our omelets. Let's get it done. I sprayed my pan with a little canola oil. It's nice and hot and ready. Right? And this is for little mama. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop her in some turkey sausage. She loves the turkey sausage, so I'm gonna go ahead and fill hers up with turkey sausage. Gonna give her a little parsley inside too. All right. And I got my little, got my little skillet helper here, my little thingamabob I got from the Dollar Tree. Yep, I'm going to let that get nice and ready. And y'all know I got my Gotham frying pan. Got to be Gotham. And I've got my heat like on a medium. Not too hot. Like a medium heat. I don't want it too hot. And see how the eggs kind of sit on the top there? I just kind of tilt it over. So I can get my omelet flipped over there. Easy. It's supposed to, it's supposed to go all the way over, but y'all know what I mean. That's fine. It can be like that. That's still cute, y'all. And see, with the Gotham, the Gotham frying pans just lets you do whatever you want. See, I can. I can change that all around. I can move it all around. I can do whatever I want. Let me check under the bottom there. Yeah, it's brown under there. Let's see how brown. Not too brown. I'll give it a few more minutes. And then I'm going to flip it over. I think I'm going to get my, my bigger spatula to help me out. Because I'm going to make sure I can flip, flip this over. Alright, there you guys go. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit more so you can see. There you go. Alright, let's get it flipped over. Ah, voila. Look at that. Perfect. Perfecto. I think that's Spanish for perfect. If it's not, I'm sorry. Cut my heat down a little bit. We just making omelets. You don't need your heat all high. Oh, look at that omelet. I'm going to zoom y'all in. Y'all got to see it. Look at the omelet. Easy, y'all. Y'all know omelets ain't hard. Well, for some people it is. I mean, I remember I had a hard time struggling flipping them over, but you just keep doing it and keep doing it. You'll learn. Just keep trying and keep trying. Oh, yeah. Smelling good. You want to smash it a little bit and make sure them inside eggs get cooked. See how it's looking under there. Flip it back over. Ha ha, look at that. Look at that with all the little pieces of turkey sausage in there. Mm. Looks amazing. And voila guys, that's it. That is our breakfast omelet. You can cook it however you want, put whatever you want in it. But we've got it done. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is a, for watching, sorry. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is Arika Misha. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media at Arika Misha. And don't forget, knowledge, knowledge is power. Thanks guys, have a good day.